Hiking is happiness is on the road. We are out in South Central Oregon heading to Art Mountain Plush. And the sun is 15 minutes from going behind this hill. So it was time to get out and get some of this Albert Rim recorded. This is uh, another place that everybody should come and see. Absolutely amazing. The feel, the smell. This is really what the majority of Oregon looks like. Sagebrush and this prairie. And a beautiful blue sky. The red light's flashing. You know, sometimes it's pretty quiet out here. Those are the rabbit hills in the distance. The sunstone mine is that way. We're going to go there tomorrow. This campsite, this is a campsite that... Uh, I don't know when it was, May or so, we camped at. But, as you can see, not too busy. This is Heart Mountain Free Campsite. There are four, five, six, I think seven camp sites here. Butting up right to the Heart Mountains. That was an old CCC camp. They had a Youth Conservation Corps camp here. And they work from here. Building trails and doing things. Pretty cool. Worth coming out to see. Worth coming out to see. Happiness is hiking. Today, we have a real treat. Just amazing. This wall right here, built by Native Americans, indigenous people, to this area. And it goes all the way along and it butts into a big rock down there. And then it comes along up in through here. And I have a feeling that they would uh, herd antelope and they would be forced along this wall. And there'd be some sort of booby trap, uh, not a booby trap, but an ambush area that they would ambush the animals. Because up on this plateau, if they were out there grazing, there's no place for them to go. They would go out there and, and the animals would know there's a cliff. So they would head back around. They would come down through here. They'd run into this wall. 
and they'd come along and then they they would be behind it and they they would uh ambush them and they would harvest they'd harvest the uh whatever they were deer or pronghorn antelope whatever this is the only way right through here this gap it's the only way up here for miles and miles but through that gap you can get up to this higher plane so this was the perfect spot for them to create this ambush a couple people walking out there just go up and around and those animals would go up this is a big point they'd have no choice but to come back this way they'd run into the wall they'd follow the wall and boom somebody put a road through here and they've destroyed part of the wall it's just amazing that they would do that you know so many times we're so short-sighted in destroying things that really should be maintained but somebody cut a road right through here but it's really a beautiful wall. I'll go look here, give you another shot of it. Beautifully constructed wall. Little lizard of some sort sunning himself. Just amazing to come across something like this. Pretty cool. These mud swallows making nests. Look at that. Look how cool that is. Little bird nest, huh? There's a bird looking out, saying, Where's my mommy? Isn't that cool? Heart Mountain Refuge. We're taking the Blue Sky Road. I've never been on it. Down there is where the hot springs are, and a really nice hike up that saddle. Susan and I have been up there. July 20th or 19th, it's actually pretty nice. It's gonna be in the 90s soon, but right now it's 70 something and it's pretty nice. This is a great place. They call this Lookout Point. The Steens. Not sure what that that mountain is called there. You can see that one from afar. A long way. Lake over there. This is, you can see why they make this a uh, antelope refuge. There's water, there's food, open spaces. This is a natural for that. Absolute natural. And a survey mark. A benchmark. That's cool. The last few rays of sunlight. Here at the Plush Mountain Mini Storage.
apartment complex. Flush Mountain doesn't have very big mini storage apartment complex. But what it has is ours. Boy, it gets way cooler when that sun goes down, boy. Got the last little bit of sun. In a matter of minutes, it's going to disappear from here. Let's see how that works. Mosquitoes are out.